Well, Dean, after the disappointment of last week, that must have been the perfect response. Yeah, it was good, wasn't it? Uh, certainly a lot more enjoyable, both to, to play and from you know, a point of view of after the game. Yeah, I think um, I think we got back and had a bit of fun, which you, it might have shown. Hopefully it did, um, but I think we thoroughly enjoyed um, performing and performing for 80, and that was the real difference. I think we've done it in periods, but we've, we, haven't, we haven't captured a, a full performance yet, and um, yeah, I think we did that reasonably well today. Rob talked about attitude as well. It's important after not to beat yourself up after the Leicester game and, and take the positive of that second half performance into that, which I think you did today. Yeah, I think the reality is the difference between, for us between a good and bad result. Um, good and bad performance, sorry, not a result, is, um, is our mentality and so that's what we're going to keep working on. I think um, when we have it right, we can, we can be a dangerous site and, uh, and when it's off, it clearly shows. So that's a real focus for us is to, to mentally get, get that right from the start of the game and then, then we can build pressure on teams. This can be one of the most hostile grounds in the Premiership. To shut the shed up like you did today is a lot down to the effort put in by all of you and the defensive effort in particular, I would say. Yeah, we've worked hard on our defence. Uh, we sort of started pre-season and, and brought in a new structure. It was always going to take a little while and there might have been a few teething issues and we've been working hard from week to week to try and work through those issues and, and today was a good result. But, yeah, as pleased as we were, yeah, the defence has got to keep going. Excuse me. And keep going up. Um, because next week's Heineken Cup and, and the challenges that go with that. So I think very, very pleased with our performance but the challenge is to keep doing it. Europe next week, as you say, is another step up again, and Cardiff Blues first up is a massive challenge. Yeah, I mean, look, look at the quality of their, their talent. I mean, yeah, on on paper they're an excellent side, and they, they might have had mixed results in the Rabo so far, but they're they're a very very good side with with quality players. You know, a number of Lions players, even more Welsh internationals. So um, they're, they're people that are renowned for for playing well in big games. So it's a it's a really big challenge for us, but I'd, I'm not sure whether they've been to Sandy Park and encompassed yeah, a rather unique experience there. So, um, yeah, I think, I think we can be confident and, and pleased with this week and it gives us some good momentum going into Europe. As we know, we've, we've talked about performances up until today being 40 minutes or here and there, but today I think was the full 80 minutes, wasn't it? Yeah, I th I, well, I think it was. I think it was, was close. I mean, you know, we could put even more, you know, there was one or two tries who are just inch, an inch away and, and the accrual of points and, and that just keeps putting pressure on, on teams. So no, I don't think uh, I don't think we can hang our hat on it, but it was it was pretty good to make Monday a lot easier. A lot of people in Cardiff are talking about the fans and the tomahawk chop for Europe. Uh, today we heard it on the terraces and the fans played their part as well. Yeah, as they always do. I mean, the shed can be reasonably uh, intimidating place, but to be 60 minutes into a game and, and hear, the, hear the tomahawk chop, as, as we can do, and um, is a full credit to, to our supporters for, for A, getting, and getting up and travelling on the road, but um, for, for making a noise when there's you know, one-tenth of them compared to the, the people in the shed and making the amount of noise is, um, is amazing. So um, thank you to them. Enjoy tonight. Thanks, mate. Thank you.